Good day everyone. This is the report of Group 1, Fabrics and Fibers. Introduction. Throughout the ages, clothing has been a reflection of both the resources available to a civilization and the level of technology in use by that civilization. Whereas, the actual fashions tend to speak volumes about the state of culture in a place and the social standing of the persons wearing them. Ultimately, the available fabrics in a society dictate how people will clothe themselves and decorate their environment. Ancient History Fabric first appeared in the Middle East during the Stone Age. The earliest sewing needle to have been found dates back to France about 19,000 BC, but possible needles has been found which date back an astounding 40,000 years. Dyed flax fibers found in a prehistorical cave in Georgia. Eurasia have been dated to 36,000 years ago. Evidence have been found of weaving in the Czech Republic in the form of impression, textile, basket, and nets on clay dating as far as 27,000 years. Innovators develop synthetic fabrics to overcome some of the inherent limitations of natural fibers. Synthetic deliver greater comfort, soil release, broader, aesthetic range, dyeing, capabilities, abrasion, resistance, color fastness, and lower cost. The man-made fibers and a steadily growing palette of synthetic additives made it possible to add flame retardancy, wrinkles, and stain resistance antimicrobial properties, and a host of other performance improvements. Fiber, a natural product from cotton, plant, animal, or wool. It is not wearable, flexible, and may be spun into yarn and made into fabrics. The first elementary raw materials of textile manufacturing a long, thin, strand, or a thread of material. The definition of fabrics. The finished product, it could be either knitted or woven. It is wearable use for making things such as clothes, curtains, and sheets. The basic structure of a building or a vehicle can also be called fabric. Artifact made by weaving, felting, knitting, or crocheting natural or synthetic fibers. There are two categories of fibers. First, natural fibers. Natural fibers are fibers obtained from plants and animals. They are further classified as vegetable fibers, animal fibers, and mineral fibers. Under vegetable fibers, there are three kinds of it. The bass fibers, second the leaf fibers, and lastly, seed and fruit fibers. Under animal fibers, there are also three kinds of it. Hair fibers, wool fibers, and lastly, silk. Mineral fibers are fibers derived from natural mineral sources or are manufactured from inorganic and mineral salts. Asbestos is a mineral fiber, and cloth made of this fiber is mostly used for industrial purposes. The second category of fibers is man-made fibers. Man-made fibers are further classified as inorganic fibers, regenerated fibers, semi-synthetic fibers, and synthetic fibers. Under inorganic fibers, there are three kinds of it. Metallic fibers, glass fibers, and man-made rubber. Under regenerated fibers, there are there are also three kinds of it. Ryan, polynosic fibers, copromonium ryan fiber. Under semi-synthetic fibers, there are also three kinds of it. Acetate fibers, triacetate fibers, and lastly, azlone fibers. And lastly, under synthetic fibers, there are five kinds of it. The polyester fibers, nylon fibers, polyurethane fibers, acrylic fibers, and olefin fibers. 28 types of fabrics Canvas Canvas is a plain wave fabric typically made out of heavy cotton yarn and to a lesser extent, linen yarn. Canvas fabric is known for being durable, 
sturdy, and heavy duty. Cashmere. Cashmere is a type of wool fabric that is made from cashmere goats and pashmina goats. Cashmere is a natural fiber known for its extremely soft feel and great insulation. Chanel. Chanel is a name for both type of yarn and fabric that makes the soft material. Chiffon. Chiffon is a lightweight, plain woven fabric with a slight shine. Chiffon has small puckers that make the fabric a little rough to touch. Cotton. Cotton is a staple fiber, which means it is composed of different varying length of fibers. Cotton is made from natural fibers of cotton plants. Cotton is primarily composed of cellulose, an insoluble organic compound crucial to plant structure that has soft and fluffy material. The term cotton refers to a part of the cotton plant that grows in the boil, the encasing for the fluffy cotton fibers. Cotton is spun into yarn, then converted into woven to create a soft, durable fabric used for everyday garments like t-shirts and home items such as bed sheets. Cotton prints and the cotton solids are available designs. Crepe or crepe. Crepe is a silk, wool, or synthetic fabric with a distinctive wrinkled and bumpy appearance. Crepe is usually a light to medium weight fabric. The Max. The Max is a reversible jacquard pattern fabric, meaning that the pattern is woven into a fabric instead of printing on it. Georgette. Georgette is a type of crepe fabric that is typically made from pure silk but can also be made from synthetic fibers like rayon, viscose, and polyester. Gingham Gingham is a cotton fabric or sometimes a cotton blend fabric made with dyed yarn woven using a plain wave to form a cheek pattern. Gingham is usually a two-colored pattern and the popular combinations are red and white gingham or blue and white gingham. Jersey Jersey is a soft, stretchy, Neat fabric that was originally made from wool. Today, jersey is also made from cotton, cotton blends, and synthetic fibers. Lace Lace is a delicate fabric made from yarn or thread, characterized by open wave designs and patterns created through a variety of different methods. Leather Leather is a fabric that is made from animal hides or skin, and different leathers result from different types of animals and different treatment techniques. Linen Linen is an extremely strong, lightweight fabric made from the flax plant. Linen is a common material used for towels, tablecloths, napkins, and bed sheets. And the term linens, example bed linens, still refers to these household items though they are not always made out of linen fabrics. Merino wool Merino wool is a type of wool gathered from the coats of merino sheep. The traditional wool is notorious for being itchy. Merino wool is one of the softest forms of wool and doesn't aggravate the skin. Modal Modal fabric is a semi-synthetic fabric made from beech tree pulp that is used primarily for clothing such as underwear and pajamas and household items like bed sheets and towels muslin muslin is a loosely woven cotton fabric it's made using the plain weave technique which means that a single weft yarn alternates over and under a single warp yarn organza organza is a lightweight sheer plain woven fabric that was originally made from silk. The material can also be made from synthetic fibers, primarily polyester and nylon. Polyester Polyester is a man-made synthetic fiber created from petrochemicals like coal and petroleum. Polyester fabric is characterized by its durable nature. However, it is not breathable and doesn't absorb liquids like sweat. Satin Satin is one of the three major textile weaves, along plain wool weave and twill. The satin weave 
creates an elastic, shiny, soft fabric with a beautiful drape. Silk. Silk is a natural fiber produced by the silkworm and insect as a material for their nest and cocoons. Silk is known for its shine and softness as a material. Spandex. Spandex, also known as lycra or elastane. Spandex is a synthetic fiber characterized by its extreme elasticity. Spandex is blended with several types of fibers to add stretch and is used for everything from jeans to athleisure to hosier. Suede Suede is a type of leather made from the underside of the animal's skin, giving it a soft surface. Suede is usually made from lab skin, but it also made from other types of animals, including goats, pigs, cubs, and deer. Tafeta Tafeta is a crisp, plain woven fabric made most from silk, but it can also be woven with polyester, nylon, acetate, or other synthetic fibers. Twal Twal de Zue, or simply twal, was a, a specific type of linen printed with romantic pastoral patterns in a single color, usually black, blue, or red, on unbleached fabric. Tweed Tweed is a rough woven fabric usually made from wool. The fibers can be woven using a plain weave or twill weaves. It is an extremely warm, hard-wearing fabric that is thick and stiff. Twill Twill is one of the three major types of textile weaves along with satin and plain weaves. The distinguishing characteristic of the twill weave is a diagonal rib pattern. Twill weaves have a distinct, often darker colored front side called the wheel with a lighter back. Velvet Velvet is a soft, luxurious fabric that is characterized by a dense pile of even light fibers that have a smooth nap. Velvet has a beautiful drape and a unique soft and shiny appearance due to the characteristics of the short pile fibers. Viscose Viscose is a semi-synthetic type of Orion fabric made from wood pulp that is used as a silk substitute as it has a similar drape and smooth feel to the luxury material. Fabric manufacture Filting, squeezing a mat of fibers together in a liquid to achieve a flat, tangled finish material. Knitting, the interlacing of yarn using a knit, the came weaving. Advantage and disadvantage of natural fiber. Advantage, comfortable environmental friendly non-allergic skin. Disadvantage, expensive drink might shrink due to aggressive washing natural fibers are not available and tenacity and medium tenacity do not possess a high degree of resiliency production of natural fiber cannot be completely controllable by ration and length fineness etc of natural fiber caused by less and regular yarn the availability of natural fibers is affected by natural calamities and vagaries of nature. The production of natural fibers involves the use of land which is also required for growing the agri-products. Advantages and disadvantages of synthetic fibers man-made. First is for the advantages. Strong. Retain their original shape. Elastic or stretchable, it is soft. Color Varieties of colors are available as they manufactured. Cheap or affordable. Produce 
deliberately and quickly under the demand. Does not require cleaning. Lightweight character. Colors can be incorporated during production. Possess high resistance of moth, insects, mold, which simplify the storage problems, influenced by positive qualities. Disadvantages Do not absorb moisture. Rough feel Some individuals are often prone to skin allergies. Hydrophobic in nature are easily worn on water. Fail to absorb perspiration or sweat. Uncomfortable to wear during hot climate. Little difficult to sew, so stitching charges were higher. 